Hi there, Julie Powell here. In this video, I'm going to show you how to export your images from Lightroom into DxO Photo Lab. So if you want to keep your Lightroom catalog, but you still want to um, play around with some different things in Photo Lab, you still can. So the first time you actually um, load Photo Lab, you will get a message telling you to do this. Um, you won't find Photo Lab in your Edit In panel. Um, what you need to do is you go to File and you go to Plugin Extras and then you go to Transfer in Photo Lab 7. And you click on that and then your image will then appear in Photo Lab 7. You can then go through and start editing as you require. Um, you've got your light, your color. Of course, you can also go into um, FX and start doing things like working with film packs um, and things like that. Once you have finished editing your image, it's a matter of clicking export to Lightroom if that is already clicked. If, if you click on the little drop down, you will find export to Lightroom there. You click on that and that will make it um, your standard export. Now, what do you want to export it as? You can export it as a JPEG, a TIFF, a DNG, which is what I recommend and I would change it as all corrections applied. Then you just hit export and it will arrive back in Lightroom. It's as easy as that. You can edit as per normal in DxO and I will go through more of that in another video. Okay, so once uh, Photo Lab has finished, it will pop back into Lightroom. Um, I did find that it did tend to put um, an image in your collections. So if you then go into your original folder, you will find when you look down, it will appear there. So you've got your original image and then next to that, you have got the DxoDNG file. So that's a file that you edited in Photo Lab. Of course, from there, if you want to go into say um, DxO Film Pack, you come back in then to edit in and DxO Film Pack is there. So I'm not quite sure why you've got Film Pack in the edit in and Photo Lab. Um, I guess it's just a difference between filters and plugins. So um, that's it for how to import um, into DxO Photo Lab um, and how to export straight out. Thanks for watching. Bye for now. Thank you.